Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to the channel. Today, we're going to be reacting to the world's 2024 opening ceremony. I am actually just recording this a little like a couple hours after T1 has already won the game and the finals here. So we're, we weren't able to catch the live performance of the world's opening ceremony. So we're just going off of like the live stream that was earlier in the day today. And yeah, I, I think I saw who was supposed to be performing. Obviously, we have like Linkin Park. I think it's Ash Nico. I, I think that's how you say your name. And then there were two other artists that I actually can't recall off the top of my head right now but let's just go into this i mean worlds is always a hype thing to watch i'm excited to watch this while you're here though please leave a thumbs up on the video consider subscribing to the channel we have a bunch of other league of legends reactions you can check out here while you are on the channel so here we go let's dive into the worlds 2024 oh we got a long 30 second countdown this is pretty epic three two one here we go this is also hype because of Arcane being in just a week away from now. Also very hype. Okay, I love the Arcane art style over all the players. Is this the Paint the Town Blue song I think it is? Okay. Now is that just what she normally looks like or does she is she trying to be like Jinx, obviously? Dude, look at the dancers. It's hype. Ooh. Okay, yeah, paint the town blue. I know this song was done for Arcane. I wonder if it'll be incorporated in the episode or in the season. Hey, this is such a hype song. Dude, there's so many dancers that have to be choreographed to be in the exact spot they're supposed to be in. There's like so many people on that stage. Mm. We're gonna be doing like a good mixture of songs, I think, this year. We got the, the Lincoln Park song after this too. Wow. Sweet intro. What's next? Never stays dead. All right, still here. Of course, that cinematic was epic this year with Kindred, Trindamir. Morgana and Kale. Okay. I forget what this uh, artist's name is. Ooh. Ooh, okay, what's going on with this performance? Wolf? Lamb's gonna be on the other side, yeah? Oh. Dude, that's a really cool effect. Still Here was definitely one of my favorite cinematics. Season cinematics for sure. Oh, there's the Morgana chains. That's cool. Ooh, full Morgana now. Dude, the, the the like the visuals here are nuts. Okay, the Yasuo part. I mean, I've watched the Still Here cinematic so many times at this point, watching other people's reactions as well. Hmm. 
Atrox. Oof, those voices are incredible. Okay. I'm still here. Favorite part of the song. So many dancers yet again, man. I love that they were singing at each other there. I love how I can just like picture every part of that cinematic during this song too. Okay. It's in my blood, it's in my veins. Ah, the players behind their banners. <laughs> That's such an epic reveal. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who is that? And what is he? I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Who that is? Ah, oh, dude, this song is so good. Oh, I love the little strut <laughs> from the dancers. That's fun. I'm interested in what's going to happen with the Linkin Park performance. I've been an avid Linkin Park fan for most of my life, so hopefully this is pretty hype here too. See Linkin Park on the stage. I think there was a fourth performance though, so I don't know who else is going up. Oh no, we're here for some Linkin Park, okay. All right. Interesting to see Emily performing live as well here. I do like this Heavy as the Crown song. I've listened to some of the other songs from their newest album. They're okay. I think this is my favorite. Okay, Mike Shinoda's killing it. All right. It sounds good. Her voice sounds real good. My favorite part is obviously when the, the big scream comes at the end of the song. And Mike Shinoda has been performing for like over 20 years at this point, right? 30 years almost. Oh, the years in the back. Cool. The crown in the middle. Oh, here it comes. Oh, that was cool. Fireworks in the middle. And then the trophy coming up. That's epic. I was gonna say, did he did he forget? <laughs> In the top lane, Bing 
Oh, okay, we're introducing them as they play the song. That's cool. I hear top lane players are crazy. Okay. <laughs> what face would you guys go out there with if you were on the stage? I don't know what I'd be doing. Of course, they're going to do Faker last. Knight and Faker, okay. It ended up being a 3-2 win for a T1, but uh, I know it was close, yeah? This is what you oh, that's cool. One more time through the chorus. How many people can fit in that uh, in that stadium that they got? I wonder how many attendants there are. That was great. This was an extra special year because Lincoln Park performed, and I've been a big fan of theirs for a very long time. So this was awesome. Still here, great song, great cinematic, as well as the Paint the Town Blue song for Arcane Season 2. Super extra hype year, I think, because of that. Like, these, all three, these three things lining up where not only did we have, you know, we're having Arcane Season 2 coming, and then we have, you know, the Still Here Cinematic 2024 Cinematic being, like, so good, in my opinion, and then Linkin Park, a band that I've listened to for, like, just growing up since growing up in the 90s and everything. Fantastic freaking year i think for worlds 2024 i definitely need to hear from everybody in the comments which one was your favorite performance here you know obviously everybody has different music tastes was it still here as your favorite was it paint the town blue i think the paint the town blue song is a little short but it's pretty hype like i do like that kind of music and everything it has me extra hype for arcane season two i think the still here song again like i could just picture every part of that cinematic during that performance and then yeah lincoln parks heavy is the crown so far has been my new favorite song from them from the new album and everything i know a lot of people were like a little iffy about it because you know it's it, we we weren't sure how lincoln park style would fit with league of legends but i think it's a great song i think it's perfect i think they killed it i think emily did a great job regardless of the controversy behind her and everything i think she did a great job performing mike shinoda and the rest of the lincoln park band so guys let me know your favorite performance where do you rank this amongst like the other world's opening ceremonies i think this one's pretty good i can't recall which one i have as a favorite right now I think like, because we did have like the COVID year of 2021 world's opening ceremony. I think that one had like Imagine Dragons. I know we had new jeans last year. So I'm not sure what my favorite is, but I do want to hear from you guys what your favorite was. And all right, guys, that's going to do it. Please leave a thumbs up on the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the rest of my League of Legends reactions in the future. Take care. Bye-bye.